historical struggle hile chikat ka hai mukhala shi pura gar mala samara chikat sar ghai ne asia khane kala historically itum kata ata na mongda khalaya thachan bi khajan sa thwe da achai na tanda okuthui ni sangme kap da khamarara naga yur okuthui na thai mi dale india go ha malai hidit khana पिस्टॉक टिकले कसाई कपाई मनी मने कसाई खबर ना लूम शंदा चुंबु भीरान का सारा पिस्टॉक सारा गाई पिस्टॉक जिला ला सांगमे कप स्ट्रगल जिला ला सांगमे कप शिमखुर जिला ला सेक्रेफाइस साला का सरेंडर मसाला इमारम कन कुइरा कन निंग गाई यू ने कची ममलायस जी बांगे ना मैं ना पी मांग मनी मने Jom ibang dah sih nak ulas lagi ni, cibang nak cik tu hidup dengan cik sergi ni, aje hidup dengan cik pi, aje mau ni mana, rada dah kalah, adam ni lah, itu kau kah yang kah sada dengan cik se, ngasan sada ngasan sada, zingrot ni lah mengaji, nomai teri ni lah mengaji lah, sim ni, ringkap apa kat orang ah, cik herai lah kah, ngalai ibang cik kah kah itu, jom ni dengan cik ni mau mula putus se. Kalau kita ada sacrifice atau cinta kerja, nama kita ada, nanti dia hangai saya. Ning mati awak saya, ning hak lap kain nak kerja jual, nanti aku isi kok nalin.
Madam Grizzly, Truck and Share, it's you, you he ninka how to me, you name, Kala itum hiba, Sara Gitimushunjili, Makamiti, you name, Kala itum Adam Gitida, Kokasare, Kala itum Adam Gitida, you to Viva Mushunjiva, and Ninjin Ray, Gitidi, Matalaga, and Yari say, Gordoli, Kasakasama Manila, Lady Glea, Ramli, Shimkuli, Kohang Misello, itum you Viva it other than the Rodale, itum Viva it with other than Ninka Lake, Gitidi, and the Palana Kasami Gajiva, or Madam Grace Lining Sherry, thank you very much. President Tang Fushin along. Uh, the Kenya Lee, I would like to request our President United Naga Council for a short speech. Please, sir, please take your time. Respected President Tang Fushin Nagalong and respected leader of the other Tang Fushin Central Organizations, church leaders, politicians, political party leaders, and students, women wings leaders, coming from different walks of life to participate in this peaceful rally here at Oku headquarter. My dear friends, we are all graduated in Naga politics. I need not to explain in detail again but after signing the history framework agreement, it was signed 3rd of August 2015. Now it is almost three years. We have been waiting eagerly, patiently, prayerfully, hopefully for the final agreement. Due to lack of political commitment on the part of the government of India, now situation is pending like this. Through this platform, I on behalf of the Naga people of South Nagaland would like to invite the attention of the Honorable Prime Minister of India to expedite the peace process, to settle the agreement at the earliest possible time. Inordinate delay will invite more problems. This is the total sentiment and opinion and view of the Naga people. Time has come for every one of us. Let's reckon today whether our future is secure or insecure. Under this present political system, our future is not secure. Our land is not secure. Our identity is not secure. Our peoples are not secure. Our person is not secure. My dear friends, government of India sometimes wrongly or deliberately utilize some forces directly or indirectly to sabotage, to hijack, to derail the peace process. Every day this system is going on everywhere in Naga countries. This is the policy of the government of India. From day one, they have applied maximum mechanism to suppress the Naga people's movement. For the last 70 years, they have exercised, they have applied, they have planned out, they have passed a lot of rules and bills to cross the Naga people's aspiration. But they could not do that. But they failed. Therefore, the only solution to this problem is political commitment, political will of the government of India is the only answer to solve this problem. My dear friends, 
to make a strong nation, we need a strong people like you. To make a strong nation, to make a strong country, a strong man, strong human, strong young man, is required. Therefore, we are here, standing that, shouting that, we are for Daga national issue. We will never compromise our total aspiration, our history to anybody. Therefore, my dear friend, let us unite. Let us unite and fight for the final settlement and our collective leadership. We totally support, our solid support is with the collective leadership. So, with this few words, let us hope and pray to God to bring, to give final settlement at the earliest. My respected President, United Naga Council and colleagues, Presidents of the different civil organizations and their colleagues, and I have seen my former DNA president, aged persons, I salute you, ladies and gentlemen. It is said that the darkest hour is just before the top. When the Naga people and the Indian our people are about to harvest the hard work and difficult political negotiations for more than two decades. Challenges are bound to happen. We will soon face much greater challenges as we near the final solution. The challenges may be from within our family or from external forces. It may even emanate from the two negotiating parties or from various institutions that affiliate with the power structures of the two negotiation parties. However, if the Naga people and the Indian in general, the leader in particular, fail to bring honorable and acceptable solution, it will be badly defeat the wisdom of why the two parties announced the ceasefire and started the political peace talks. Therefore, it is crucial time. The situation demands a strong sense of understanding between the Naga people and the Indians. We must not forget why the ceasefire agreement was signed and the political negotiations started. The journey peace between the Naga people and the Indians have crossed many milestones, which can soon become a model of how difficult political conflict can resolve peaceful. Many Indian leaders including successive prime ministers of India have exhibited sensitivity and wisdom in addressing the Naga Indo-political conflict. We all know a big breakthrough was made on 3rd August 2015 by signing the framework agreement between the Naga people represented by National Socialist Council of Nagaland and the Indian represented by government of India. The fact that the announcement of the final solution has been delayed for more than two years after the framework agreement was signed reminds us the complex nature of the issue. It is therefore very important for all the responsible individuals, both Nagas and Indians, to give every possible support and cooperation for a peaceful and honorable solution. The institutions from both the parties, including its military wings, must assert and facilitate in bringing the final settlement. Our very action and attitude will determine the future prospect of both the two peoples, including the fact of the Northeast region, we appreciate.
the wisdom exhibited by the Honorable Prime Minister of India, Sri Narendra Modi ji, a man of decision, in placing the Naga accurately for regional alliance and cooperation with the Asian country. The Honorable Atokilon Sirti H. Muiva have also expressed that the Indian can count on us in their interests beyond the frontiers. We have so much gain from each other when we learn to see each other as a partner than as an adversary. Opportunity await us. Let us not miss it because of our short-sightedness or for vested interest. The solution between the Naga people and the Indians will be big enough to serve the fruits to all the neighboring communities. Victory to our people and talent. Good night. People of Ukru in general, thank you once again to our respected friends, uh, I mean president. Issue with Lianxi with President Le, it with framework agreement. Kala it with Tocha, Kala Nana Kaling and Ningra, Nanaga Nasa the Ki or Taran Gitimoramli, Itum Lima Talaga and Hanjitere, Itum Saikora, Atuma Taikawa, Kala Atuna Taikui, Atsura Itum Hami Gaiti with one other, Itum Nala Kami Tok, Kala Itum the Tankuno, Kala Nagano, E. Majuna Akasada, Chui, Karajan Totan to any to Ninqui La Grakal and Ninka La Gravity, Shika Sir Gitihan Kakalie. Thank you, Madam President of Ningxiere, Anna, Itum Wivan, Kala Itum Nangrana, the Heshwansa Wivan, Kala Yuaka and Akakata Itum, Chinomram, Nomra Akasada of Tirumra, Kala Itum, mighty Indian, Itum Hakwe Kurgitia, Indian Nikata Itum, a broad Sanaka, Itum with final solution, Kinana Glav, Chimurumli, Richum of Saigorli, Matalaga, Hamji Temere, Itum Saigor, Rimpalaga, and Nakuhera, Baptalaga, and Rajishik, and the Jan Lee. Okay. Are we Itum with Kukupa Sihahi Mukichorum Lagra? Brother Mukatioka changes. Are we actually eaten the rally gazette? Finalized into Naga political talks based on 3rd August 2015. Kajimura Mili, historic framework agreement. Kajimura Mili to the peace release and Laga. He and Mobile, Ka, eaten with Prime Minister Lee, Misan Kavai, Memorandum Kapiga Haiji, Tanku, Nagala with General Secretary, the Memorandum G. Yari Mangalika, Pashok Miharano. Memorandum submitted to Sri Narendra Modi ji, Honorable Prime Minister of India, by the Tampul Naga Civil Societies on the occasion of public rally at Ukrol District Headquarters on 2nd June 2018 through the Deputy Commissioner Ukrol to finalize into Naga political talks. Honorable Sir, the Naga people in general and the Tankul in particular express the sincere appreciation and acknowledgement of the statesmanship of the Honorable Prime Minister of India, Sri Narendra Modi ji, and the NSN collective leadership on the hammering out of the prestigious framework agreement on 3rd August 2015. The protracted talks and the prevailing conditions and the circumstances especially upon the Dankul community by various external agencies and forces have compelled for leading the long-awaited solution based on the spirit of the above-mentioned framework agreement. We take this privilege in reminding the Honorable President on the following points. Number one, that any political agencies or state machineries jeopardizing the peace process must be condemned as the common enemy of Nagalim and India. Number two, that the only solution to the into Naga political issues is considered the hand for lifting the veil of hardship inflicted thus far upon the Naga community. 
Number three, that various agencies and forces of the government of India are indifferent to the well-being of the Naka community in view of the delayed solution. Number four, that the government of India can maintain better relations with the other governments in this global world by creating conducive atmosphere of peace and tranquility within Nakas. Number five, that sanctity of the ceasefire crown rules be maintained in Nakalim. Number six, that the sincerity and integrity of India shall be put to the strength of a shoestring if the voice of the public goes unheeded. In spite of all the problems faced by the Nakas, we still do have the faith and belief in the government of India under the able leadership of Sri Narendra Motichi, the Honorable Prime Minister of India. It is therefore our earnest appeal to the Honorable Prime Minister of India to expedite the indo naka political solution at the earliest based on the spirit of framework agreement signed on 3rd August 2015. Sincerely yours, V. Wibben Simic, President Dankul Nakalong, Dankul Abex Body, Chris D. Shatsang, President Dankul Shinalong, Dankul Women's League, A.S. Rangam, President Dankul Kadam Nausaglong, Dankul Students Union, L.M. Tanmi, President Dankul Meir Nalalong, Dankul Youth Council, Dearson Chamroy, Chairman Dankul Naga Ato Longpang, Dankul Northern Zone, N.S. Varemi, Chairman Dankul Naga Zingshu Longpang, Dankul Eastern Zone, Mangang Raman, Chairman Dankul Naga Zingon Longpang, Dankul Western Zone, Shomi Angang, Chairman Dankul Naga Aze Longpang, Dankul Southern Zone, Kobi 2, Number 1, The Honorable Ato Kilonser, NSCN, GPRN. Number two, the Honorable Prime Minister, Government of India. Number three, Sri R.N. Revi, Interlocator. Number four, German Ceasefire Monitoring Group. Mr. Henry, is your generous Katrili, Tamku Nagalangwe. Yang Saikura, Ari Memorandum Chi, Nyang Ulap, Hadera, which we should get some lay. Nyang Ulap, Hadera, Akshi, the Panga Pizza Jones. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I'm on behalf of the Dankul Nagalo, I would like to give a gratitude to all the me media person over here and those who are outsiders who came over here for today's meet for leaving all his unceasing words. So, with the Dankul organizations and the Dankul Nagalons, the frontier organization of Dankuls would like to once again, give a thank you. I would like to give our gratitude to you all for your endeavor. Thank you very much. Are we eating now? I